everybody! So today I'm doing an unboxing for um, Vic's Superhero. Ta-da! Um, I actually bought this off of somebody. So there's the front. Uh, there's the side. Another side, another side. So like I was saying, there's the back with the track list. I did buy this off of somebody. Um, Pre-owned, I guess you could say. There's a lot of Facebook groups online that sell their they sell their own things that they don't want anymore. So I got this. Uh, she sold it seven dollars with shipping. Ended up about thirteen dollars. So that's how much I paid for this. So it's not new, but kind of close. This lighting is horrible. Oh my god! I just noticed that it's really creased right here. They put pressure on it. I'm going to assume that was from... You can't even see it, but it's right there. I'm going to assume that's just from the packaging because this is what it came in. A bubble mailer. No reinforcement or anything. It's actually not even a bubble mailer. Just... Yeah. So I'm going to assume that's how it got damaged. Anyway, so I haven't opened it. I'm really excited to look at it. Um, so right here, you see them right... Uh, that's Makne, Leo, Rave... Hongbin, this is Ken, and Leader N. So you open it up, there's a CD. Right, right there, that's a CD. And you have the photo book over here again, same order as outside. Um, you can kind of, a little bit, see N's forehead right there. N's forehead, it's one of those things that you sh never see. It always has to be covered up or censored, like in... Um, the, what was it? M Diaries? No, MTV Diaries. There we go. I actually just started watching um, Plan V. I just watched one episode. I just finished. So this is the first um, page. This is group shot. So you have Bravi, Ravi, Gravioli, Ken, uh, who's in the middle? Leo, Leo in the middle in the crease. Uh, Hongbin, N, and Makne. Uh, Hyuk. Who's this? This be Leo. This is my friend's bias. Woo, Leo. You got Hongbin. I loved his hair in this era. His hair was perfect. And then they cut it for Rock Your Body. And I was like, uh, but, oh well. I mean, that's their concept. There's leader N. I think you can kind of see part of his forehead again. No. No, I guess it's not part of his forehead. It's actually highlights. My bad. So I guess that's what you see in the front also. They're highlights. It's different um, color. And I, I don't know what that says right there. So it's in Korean. Can't read that. So this is their debut single. Or their debut album. Superhero. So right after my doll aired, um, that's Ken by the way, this came out. Rave! I love him. His beautiful perfect hair. And they cut it for this next album. <laughs> it hurts. <laughs> oh, his beautiful hair. They cut his beautiful hair. There's Makne. But the good thing is that it will grow back. So that's, yeah. But he really looks like Suga now from BTS. With, um, there's Leo from the Dark and Wild concept. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, they did just, uh, Vix just released their teaser fi pictures. There's Hongbin. Hongbin, I really loved his hair. His hair was beautiful. I hope he grows it out one day again. And because that, it was pretty. Later in. Ken. I'm excited about their new single, though, or their new album. I'm actually gonna pre-order it. Rabbit! 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 Him and his beautiful hair. <sighs> And then you have Makne. Yuck. 
I actually got my Voodoo album the other day, and instead of it saying Hyuk on one of the pages, it says Kyuk. So right here you have the track list, which is Superhero, Starlight, Superhero Instrumental. Um, you have the Superhero Lyrics. Uh, lyrics by, Compose, Chorus, Rap Making, Rabe. And then you have Starlight, uh, Rap Making with Rave again. So these are the, that's that. And you have um, producer, things about the album. Not things about the album, but people who worked on the album right here on this page. <whistles> Choreography, Mana School. And then you have a group, oops, so sorry. The polish. It's glow in the dark, you guys. Uh, then you have the group shot right here, Vix, and the boys. I never understood what Leo was wearing, why he would wear that. He seems so conservative, but I guess it's just because he's really quiet. Oh, that's it, by the way. There's nothing else after that. Leo just seems really quiet, so it's kind of a shock for me to see that he was wearing that, especially on their debut. Usually it takes a while before um, artists start, or the guys start taking off their clothes, they got their shirts. So that was kind of like a whoa, when I first, after I learned that he was a quiet one. Um, yay! I actually have more albums at my house now, I've been buying a lot. Um, I have about 10 or 11 now, <laughs> and I only started off with Doom Dot at the very beginning, then I went to KCON, went crazy, bought a couple, and then I did a pre-order for BTS, and with that I had gotten two other ones, of Vix Eternity and then her, and now I have this one, I have Voodoo, I have, um, what other albums do I have? I have a lot of crap now. I have. Uh, another BTS album, the um, Oh Are You Late 2, I have, I have a lot. And now I'm gonna get the new one. I'm actually collecting, I don't know why, I, I don't think I'm officially a Starlight. I'm not. Just that I really like their photo books. And I'm getting the CDs, and then um, now I'm listening to them. Because before I would just get their singles, and download their singles, and then listen to that. But now I'm actually getting their CDs. Or getting their uh, Vix's albums and listen to them I'm like holy cow how have it I've been missing out on all this so that's what I'm doing now and I'm really liking their music so that's why I'm continuing to buy their albums so I need a couple more now I just need rock your body on and on hide and uh, I think that's it oh Jekyll yeah Jekyll also so I need a couple more albums to complete my whole disco disco discography of Vix. I need one other one. I need the debut album of BTS to have their disco disco discography. Oh my, I can't even say it. To have all their albums. And I also need special edition. <sighs> but I'm, I'm working on it. Oh, and I also got Big Bang special edition top version. So I, I have a collection now. And I wasn't supposed to. I really need to stop spending. After I buy my new big CD. Because <laughs> ah, their concept pictures came out today and I'm excited. And we're all excited and we're like, woo! Because we're coming back next week. Yay! Anyways, so I'll be getting that album soon in a couple weeks. And maybe you'll see a video about it later. I don't know. It depends if I have time or if I remember to make um, an unboxing. The rest I have at my house. Maybe eventually I'll do an unboxing. Anyways, eee.